First issue. I think it's a two two person job. Okay, good morning guys. So today's video, we're going to IKEA. I'm so excited. So I finally moved my suitcases and everything. So the entire like living space is actually clean now. But my room on the other hand is, yeah, we're not even gonna talk about that. Anyways, my friend Harriet's on her way here. So I'm just gonna finish up getting ready and everything. And hopefully by the time I'm ready, she'll be here. So she doesn't have to wait for me or anything. But yeah, I'm so excited. I've never been to Ikea in Australia. I have a lot of things I need to get, like little knickknack type of things. But I wanna get one of those drawers, you know, that one that every single beauty guru in like 2012 had. I need that because I need somewhere to put like my uni textbooks and like uni books because I don't have like storage for that. So yeah, so that's, today's like plan and everything okay yeah so i tidied up i made it like a bit more homely i usually like put the blanket away but i was like nah i don't know if it's cuter or not with the blanket i don't know those two pillows are not mine that one on the other hand is mine i got it from like that was like on my bed in boarding school and stuff Okay, so Harriet's the one who found this, and so this is one of the contenders. It's not the beauty guru shelf thing, but I really like yeah. it. It's really pretty. So we were thinking of like putting it in the same spot that I told you guys about, but it's really cute. So we got the details for it. Thank you, Harriet. You're welcome. Okay, so this is the one I was originally thinking of, but after seeing the one Harriet pointed out, I really want that one. I don't know. I think it's cooler, but this one's cool because it has wheels and stuff. Would you use it for like your makeup and stuff? Or just uh, get another one for that? No, I reckon just like uh, for this one, I was thinking of like putting so laptop charger, um, university books, stuff like that. But then like this one's like too. You could put stationery in there. Yeah. Okay, yeah. That's smart. And then like here, like I don't know what I'd put in it. This is like the taller one, but then me and Harriet just discussed how weird it would look in the spot because it's very skinny. Okay, and we found these, and I think they're so cute. So I was thinking of putting like tea bags in them and then just having them right next to the kettle you know so i think i'm gonna get one of these and then that's the two box that we definitely need because we will be building the ikea furniture today so well attempting to okay so when harry and i first walked in we saw that they had frozen yogurt so that's what we're gonna try and find right now okay and then another thing we're getting is this one because i already have one similar to this from like when i was in boarding school it's like a rainbow of like pink with like different colors so i think like the white one with it will look really cute and then since it is winter we'll like make good use out of it we also got like a couple other glasses and this jar and i was thinking that it can be a vase and it can also like be used for like summery drinks and stuff i don't know i thought it was cute and the glasses for like iced coffees and like matcha And I got the vanilla soft serve. We're at dusk looking at candles, but I think we're gonna go to Kmart right now. Yeah. Guys, Harriet found her mirror. We're just getting it from Kmart. We're currently in Kmart and a keep cup. So that's what we've been doing. And I think we're gonna have dumplings for lunch. So we're just gonna head to the checkout. Um, so Harriet and I got prawn dumplings, chicken dumplings, and some fried rice. Okay, so we just found the car. And then we have all of our stuff from like Kmart and Ikea and the rest of our food because we don't finish it. Yeah. Okay, hey guys. So it's been a couple of days. It's actually day three of the lockdown. Surprise. Past Laura probably didn't know we were going to have a lockdown. It's the third day of the lockdown and I decided it's the best time to order the Ikea furniture online because I'm going to be at home and I don't have university on at the moment. So I'll actually have a chance to assemble the stuff myself. So I'm just ordering it online. I thought I'd show you guys what I'm getting. It's basically what I showed you guys in the store, but a little extra. And yeah. Okay, so this is what I'm getting. This is a candle. I'm currently using it now and I absolutely love it. And then this is the shelving that I showed you guys that Harry actually pointed out to me. It's not the one I, like I went to Ikea with the one I wanted to get, but then I came out wanting this one. So I'm getting this and then I'm getting four of these like white boxes because they actually like match and go in. So I'm only getting four because I just want to cover the bottom ones and then the top ones I'll have books and candles and photo frames and stuff on it. And yeah, so I'm just going to order that now. 
Okay, so finally I'm putting together. I've been putting this off for the longest time. I'm gonna finally put the bookcase together. That's why I went to IKEA mainly to get. And um, guys, I want to say I ordered this in the first week of lockdown and probably got it in the second week. I think we're in like the fourth week of lock. I have no idea what week we are of lockdown, but I think it's been extended twice already. So that should put things into perspective. Okay, anyways, so this is it, and I'm gonna be putting it together. I have my own toolbox and everything. I bought it. Um, you guys probably have probably seen it in the vlog. Okay, so dilemma number one is my toolbox has like zip. My toolbox is like zip tied shot. I, I think I bought the one that was like a model or whatever. I don't know, but I'm trying to like get my scissors through it. So. Okay, so I got it open, and yeah, I don't know. Oh, okay, that's really cool. Yeah, I don't know what I'm going to be needing to use. I think I'm just going to need a screwdriver, to be honest. But this is my um, toolbox haul. Do you guys want to see what's in it? So I got a hammer, screwdriver, thing. Is this a wrench? I feel like this would be a wrench. Like, if I would have to name something a wrench, I feel like this one would be it. And then this one, I'll just like say tweezers or like pliers. Okay. Whoa. Oh my god. I think I'm just gonna cut open the box. You can see this side, but I think I'm just gonna go. So, the first and last thing that I ever made, like IKEA furniture wise, was a table, and that was probably like four months ago. And this is a massive bookshelf. So I'm really hoping it's not like that hard. Like putting the table together was so easy. So like, again, can you really compare a table and a bookshelf? I don't, is this a bookshelf? I actually have to like sit through and put this out. Because one, if I don't, then all the stuff is just gonna be all over the place. And two is like, you can't have someone come and put it together. Okay, so I opened it and then there's like a little piece of cardboard here and I just put these pieces on top of it. I'm trying to find the instructions and like all the screws and whatever that have come with it. And once like I lay it out, I'll try and figure out like how to put it together and I'll update you guys. Okay, so I found it and I found like all the screws and all the stuff. I think this is like for baby proofing. I'm like to like put it on the wall, but I don't think I'll be doing that. But I found the instructions and I'm gonna try and like figure out how to do it. Ah, yes. First issue, I think it's a two, two person job. See that there? Nah, I can do it by myself. What I think I'm gonna be doing, I'm just gonna lay out on the ground how it's meant to look like, and then from then just like start screwing it together. Let me show you. <laughs> this is it. I'm so excited. I think it will work out, hopefully, inshallah. Inshallah it does. Um, okay, so I struggled a bit, like, putting one of the screws in. So I just realized that I needed to apply more pressure, and I did. So I have the L shape, this part done. And I just have to, like, screw these things in here, or, like, hammer them in. And, yeah, I think it's going to be good from here, hopefully. Fingers crossed. Lightning stricken cactus and it starts to rain Okay, look at this. It's coming along just fine. Look, I just have to do this part and then I'm so happy. Okay guys, I'm really getting the hang of it. So I only have like that piece left to do this one. Then the top part and then the other side of this over here and I'm done. That's so, I'm so happy. Okay, so I just hammered in all the little wooden things and I only have the side part and the top part left to do but I think I do the side part first and then I do the top part. So, yeah. Okay, hey guys, can you guess where I'm filming from? I did it. I did it. Akia said you needed two people, I did it by myself. Anyways, I'll show you guys what it looks like. So this is what it looks like. I just, I literally just did it there because I want to have like the rest of this wall be Polaroids. So like that go all the way up to there. And then I feel like I'm gonna put out my cameras here. So like my Polaroid and like the film cameras and stuff like that. And then I think these bottom four, I'll like put the baskets in them. And then here I'll just have like my books and stuff. Okay, so I did buy like four of these. And the reason why I didn't get so like eight and stuff, I I bought four because I feel like if I let all of like all my stuff show, I feel like it would be too cluttered, and I just don't like seeing all my stuff. I like if I 
if I had a walk-in, like, oh, I think it would be different if I had a walk-in wardrobe. Like, I'd like to see all my stuff out, but I don't like, see, I like everything to be inside the shelf. I don't like looking at the stuff. So I put my cameras up here just so it's like easy to grab them. So I usually take this when I go out, but I'll be using this one when like my friends come over because I want to do like a Polaroid wall, like the one behind that you can see. I put like books in that there. Guys, but this gives me very much mom at beach house vibes. My mom bought this for me, but I literally, I had nothing else to put on these things. So I just decided to go with this. These two are empty. And then these are the boxes I put together from Ikea as well. I just ordered them online. They're all empty, but I'm like thinking of putting my uni stuff in here because I study at the table next to it so that way I just grab the box and I just have all my uni supplies in like one place and stuff like that so yeah okay so that's it for this video if you guys can comment down like what I should put on the shelves and stuff like that because I actually need suggestions for that I was thinking some plants so I might go look and see if I can get some delivered or and stuff because like we're in lockdown right now but yeah other than that I hope you guys enjoyed this video and comment down like videos you want me to see doing on this channel and yeah if you want to watch some Arabic vlogs I have my other channel and you guys can go check that out if you like okay so bye guys thank you so much for watching love you all so much and yeah see you guys next week